What causes problems in the fall with algae? Are, are there weeds that are causing problems? Uh, the two major are ragweed and mold. Ragweed and mold. Now, what is ragweed? Ragweed is a very common weed. It grows in a lot of areas with newly disturbed ground. It's a, it's a heavy pollinator. Uh, pollinates in the 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. range. Uh, blows for hundreds of miles. So it's pollen is a little grain that comes from a plant. Then. Sure. And it floats around in there. How does that cause allergy? Well, we inhale the allergen and it causes allergic reaction. Reaction. So those allergic reactions, what symptoms? Well, the classic are just itchy, watery, runny nose, uh, runny eyes, uh, itching of the eyes, sneezing, frequent sneezing attacks. Sort of drives people uh, crazy. Absolutely. It? And Very their big eyes business. are driving them crazy and their nose is driving them crazy. And then they just get what? They just get a blocked head? Uh, very often a lot of nasal congestion. Nasal congestion is the number one most common symptom of allergies, but uh, you can get some fatigue, you can get some asthma with it. You can sometimes see an increase in the frequency of respiratory infections, sinusitis, bronchitis. Uh, so it's not just a simple fall allergy problem. It can really destroy somebody's life almost. Some people get ill from, from their... Quality of allergies. life issues then would Major be... Major quality of life. Uh, fatigue, malaise, they don't feel good with their allergies? Sometimes decreased concentration, just uh, I have them myself and you can feel like you have a cold sometimes with allergies.